Hey guys, welcome to the video for guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a backup of your iPhone to your MacBook. Now, backup is really important if you ever need to restore your data back to uh, the same device or another new device. If you have it locally on your computer, it's a good way to save your information. So let's show you how that's done. Now, it's going to be really simple and easy. First thing you want to do is, of course, connect your iPhone to your MacBook like you would if you were charging. So just take your charging cable, connect one end to, of course, your iPhone, and then the other end to your MacBook. Here I'm using the USB-C port. And once you're connected, it should charge and then ask you if you want to install the update. Now, you don't have to do the update here. After that, what you'll do is on your computer or your MacBook here, you're going to open up Finder. Now, on the newer MacBook, you don't need to download iTunes but if you have a PC you might need to uh, install iTunes which is free to download but I'm gonna go ahead and open up now once you open up finder all you're gonna do is look at locations here and click on iPhones so that's connected here and it's gonna show up here and it's gonna load up and show you there now to create or make a backup here all we do is back up now. So if you do a backup now here, now it will tell you when the last time there was a backup to the iCloud, but that doesn't matter because we want to create it on our MacBook. Now, before you do back it up, right, or create a backup, if you want to encrypt it, right, put a password on it to protect your password and sensitive personal data, you can select this option and then put a password in. Now that's optional, but just to back it up, all you do is click on backup now and it will ask you if you want to encrypt or not. Let's say you want to encrypt, maybe it's good, but if you don't, you just click on either option and it will start the backup process here. Now we need to trust the computer, so enter your phone's passcode here. So I'm gonna put in the passcode here and it will start backing up the data. Now depending on how much data you have, it could take a couple minutes to sometime 10, 15 minutes. So you'll just wait to see that status bar working as you can see it's backing up and as you can see I don't have too much data here so it should be pretty quick for me but for you it could take longer again depending on how much data you need to back up but it's good to have a backup like I said if I ever need to restore you might have seen this option to restore the same exact process would go you would come connect to your device or new device like iPhone and then if you click on restore it will restore it from that backup so as you can see here, it's still going through, doing a backup here. And we're still waiting for this process to complete. We're almost there. And let's see how long this takes. And it's still backing up again. So it, sometimes it takes a couple times in navigation, but once you see this and it says backup to this MacBook and the timestamp, your local time, that means we have a backup and you can click on to manage backup as well. But that's how you Mac, uh, to do a backup from your iPhone to your MacBook. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please make a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. See you guys next time.